Prezi tutorial for beginners, how to use Prezi in 2023. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. I bring you back with yet another video and in this video we're going to be talking about Prezi and how it is the best choice that we're going to use for presentations, classroom, and a whole lot of other things. So there's different tutorials on specific tools like this one, but now let's talk about how you're going to create a basic account and use it on Prezi. Okay, so to start things off, obviously you're going to come over to Prezi.com and once you're on Prezi.com, right here you can see presentations that move audience and you get three choices for business for student and for educators so obviously it depends on whichever type of uh, category you're gonna go with now for example i just want to do it for business okay you can do it for students and stuff if you're a teacher as well but i'm just gonna go with that and here i'm gonna go ahead and click on get started for free now once you do that there's this whole sign up process that you have to go through Okay, it's going to ask you to add an email, uh, then you're going to have to ask a good old strong password as so. Choose the department, so it could be IT, marketing, HR, engineering, finance, you know, just go with any of them. I'm going to go with engineering and click on continue. Now, once you've gone with that, it's going to take you through the loading status. And here it's going to give you start your 14 day free trial today. And these are the three basic plans that you have to work with. And I'm going to get into these later, but you can start your free trial on these right away. I'm just going to go ahead and continue with the basic. Now, once you're over here, it gives you the option to invite your team, but I'm just going to skip it and show you how you're going to do it in real time in the Prezi program. And once you're here, it says, how would you like to start? Create personalized interactive presentations, video presentations, and infographics, or explore more content. So you have four options here. Create a presentation, record a video, create an infographic, and explore samples. Again, we're just going to go ahead and skip this because I'm going to show all of this to you later on. Now, once we load in, it's going to bring us here to our basic dashboard. So here it says, hi, John, are you ready to create your first impression? And I sure am. So to you know start things off, here it says uh, create for template, start from scratch and convert PowerPoint. Obviously it depends on us on whatever type of uh, category we want to go with. Let's say I'm going to go with the all project first because this is the place where you're going to find all of your basic stock standard projects. And over here is uh, you can get tons and tons of products uh, and projects in the space because you do not have any limit unless you're on the free plan if you're on the free plan then you might have a limit so i would recommend you to update that but yeah once you're over here you have these three things you know create new presentation create new infographic create new video now it depends on you on what kind of thing you want to create let's say i want to create a presentation so i'm going to come here and now we have two options create for template and start from scratch. You can convert a template from a PowerPoint as well, but uh, I would more prefer either the template or scratch. Now, the fun thing about templates is that if you open this up and actually see the templates that Prezi provides us, you'll be shocked by the absolute amazing variety and great features these templates actually have. So look at these. These look amazing, great variety, great look great features with great widgets all around so you know overall really good stuff right now let's say i'm just going to choose one of these so i'm going to go with this one you know that looks pretty professional and i'm going to come back here and i'm also going to click on start from scratch so i'm going to show you one with a template so this is a template one that you can make off of or you can start one totally from scratch now to start from scratch Obviously, it's going to be an untitled PPT or a presentation, and you're going to open it up. And in front of you is going to be a basic, you could say, editor type view where we're going to be editing our presentation. So this is how it's going to look. Now, if you've used PowerPoint, then you probably have a good idea on how you're going to be able to use this. So, you know, add your title. I'm going to call it first slide. OK, and once you've done that, you click on it. You can make the text bold, you can italicize it, you can change the text colors if you want to, give the text a background, choose your fonts. Let's say I'm going to go with this font. So you get the point of it. It's really simple, really easy, and really amazing stuff 
to work with then if you click over here this is where you can add images okay so that's why it says double click to edit so double clicking for edit really makes it simple and easy for you to work out on and uh, i would also recommend using this feature for yourself because adding photos is just a great way to gain engagement so even over here you can use stock images that prezi provides you with or you can use images by yourself by clicking on upload that totally depends on you you can add different elements by clicking on shape and a whole lot more and once you're done with all your editorial sequences you can just click on present from there click on start presentation and once you present obviously if you have a lot of things to present look at that that is how your presentation is going to look great animation great everything so you know that is what prezi actually provides you and moving on that's obviously only the presentation bit now let's go ahead and actually talk about the other two as well you have videos and infographics now you can record you know business videos to show people that hey guys uh in this video i'll be showing you how you are going to you know um work with the new workspace etc etc you know videos like that and here it's obviously going to tell you you're going to need the latest version of google chrome Without that, obviously, the Prezi video app will not work, or you can just download the whole software of the Prezi video app. You can just do that if you want to. But yeah, you get the point. And you can also import different templates, okay? Seamlessly import PowerPoint files into Prezi video, and obviously just download a Prezi video app for your desktop if you want to work with that in more detail and depth. Then moving on comes infographics which are also a pretty important part of a presentation. And there's like, you could call them analytics, graphs, and, all, and you know, things like that, which give a, uh, you could say, summarized output of information. And again, you can start these from template and a whole lot more. You have reports, infographics, posters. I'm going to go ahead and start from template over here. Once you go and start from template, it's going to open up a look for it. So here you can see a lot of different infographic looks. Now, infographics are really important for, you know, businesses and their meetings because they give you a summarized output. And, you know, you've seen movies where people are like holding those cue cards with lasers and they're like pointing lasers at it and giving a presentation. Those are infographics. And that's why I'm telling you infographics are really important for your business meetings. And trust me, you will not regret making these. So just go ahead and choose any random infographic. So let's say I'm going to go with, uh, let's go with this one. This one looks really nice. It looks like a really good design that I could, you know, work around with. So once it loads up, you're just going to go ahead and click on use a template. I'm just going to name it random. Who can see this design? Uh, I'm going to go with people. I share it with only. Okay. And once you do that, you're going to click on next click on continue and obviously as we did with our you know scratch template for our presentation we're going to work the same way for this one and uh, obviously it depends on us on whatever kind of designs we want to fill it with and whatever kind of work we want to put into it obviously when it comes to the editing of different infographics and different designs uh it's your choice to add whatever type of styling you want to but uh, at the end of the day whatever template you choose constitutes and stands for whatever design you're going to make because as you can see i went for a very warm design now if i were to change the colors of this and change the whole layout then it would make no sense whatsoever for me to choose this layout because i'm just changing the whole layout and uh, obviously there's tons and tons of other infographics design that you can use for yourself and allow yourself to just become a great, you know, uh, analytical creator. So, yeah, that's basically what uh, Prezi is. And as you can see, for your businesses or even for students or, you know, different workers, this is an amazing software okay prezi basically makes things so much easier for you things you needed to do on powerpoint and all these other softwares that took you a lot of time you can do this in the matter of seconds using templates on prezi so yeah uh, i would 100 percent recommend it and get the upgraded version if you can but yeah that's pretty much about it for this video though i hope you all enjoyed watching that if you did drop down a like subscribe to the channel and i'll see all of you next time goodbye